Welcome to Spielberg for another exciting Formula One race. This circuit is renowned for its backdrop, surrounded by natural beauty, and it certainly is an idyllic destination for the Austrian Grand Prix. The Spielberg circuit then is situated 700 metres above sea level, with just 10 corners making up one of the shortest laps of the season. One time around here is a distance of around 2.6 miles, with the best overtaking chances into turn one or the tight uphill of turn three. So with the race not far away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. World champion Max Verstappen starts from pole position and the smooth operator Carlos Sainz completes the front row. Considering the rest of the grid, we have Leclerc, Perez, Norris, Oscar Piastri, Fernando Alonso, Hamilton, Stroll, Russell, Ocon, Sargent, Ricardo, Albon, Gasly, Hulkenberg, Bottas, Sonoda, Joe, and Kevin Magnussen fills the last spot on the grid. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. And alongside me today, a man who I'm always pleased to see join me in the commentary box, Anthony Davidson. I know what we've got to do before the start of today's race, but what about our driver? What do the final hours look like for them? Well, for them, you know, you've got your pre-race rituals that you go through. You see different drivers uh, that, you know, some have got their headphones on, they're listening to the music. Some drivers really absorb the energy from the crowd and they're there waving to them. Other drivers, they go within themselves. They chat to their engineers, absorbing that information, that vital information that you need to carry you through the race. And, you know, those pre-race rituals are essential to making things systematic. We do a lot of Grand Prix in a season, and the more systematic you can be, the easier you are within that environment. now enables, DRS enables. Okay, good work, great pass. That was the fastest lap of the race. Keep this up. Well done.
Okay, final lap. Let's go. Final lap. And Leclerc to the line, to the checkered flag. It's King Charles today. He wins. Race win, fastest lap as well. So that extra point for them today. And what a masterful performance. They really showed a clean pair of heels to the rest of the opposition out there today. They had no answer for them. Looking at the podium, you can see that red suit familiar to fans across the globe. A world-class win for a world-class team. Ferrari, do it again. And with that, we wrap up another weekend of motorsport action. But with more races lined up, be sure to join us when we come back with more Formula One.